girl. Hi guys, my name is Jazz. Welcome back to my channel. This is a, probably gonna be another weekly vlog. I Now you know how you guys always encourage me, support me, and you tell me like if things don't go perfect, go along with the vlog. I'm trying to be more natural <laughs> and not such a perfectionist, but this vlog is nothing how I thought it was going to be. Um, so first, I was supposed to be going to DR this week. I had to postpone my trip. Um, Everybody's fine. I was supposed to go with my um, boyfriend, but we had, he had we had to postpone it. And I just don't even, you know how you just like something happens. You just like I don't even want to talk about it. I just don't even want to talk about it. So we had to postpone the trip. So I was like, great. I think for Monday and Tuesday, I was like in this depressive state. Of course, like there's nothing to be depressed about. But I was just like, I think it was just like the PMS, the trip getting postponed. I was just like, so I'm done. <laughs> Just take me, what is it? Get, get, take me out, just take me out. Like, literally, I was just like, you know what? I I, I don't even have anything to say. So, um, I didn't plan to really be in New York until Thursday, coming back Thursday and being here for Friday. So, my whole week was kind of, not a mess, but kind of just like a little over the place. So, um, I was like, oh, I don't have anything to, not that I don't have anything to post, but I just thought, my content was gonna be vacation-y and I'm like, okay, it's not. So we gotta pivot and do things a little bit differently. So today, it's gonna to be pretty much an eventful weekend of just going out. This morning, There's it's really early, it's 5.51 and I'm trying to get to the gym. Um, I'm downloading my video that I want to go up this past Thursday, like my just beauty favorites from the summer. I've been having issues with my computer, guys. It just seems like every time I'm trying to upload a video these days, and I don't know if it's because I'm uploading more, but I'm having issues every time I upload. Like, I took my computer to the Apple store. Mind you, I got my computer, what did I get it, like 2017? Or 2018, I got it right when I started my blog in 2018. Excuse me, I got a new computer. And it's just slow. He told me that the hard drive is like really old pretty much. Like now like the, the MacBooks are like operating at like 10, I don't know, I don't know the terminology cause I'm not like a tech geek, but they like a MacBook Air starts at like 11 gigs like processor and mine's at a two. So I was like, all right, let me just change how I download. Like I just have to use this for now until I'm ready to get the computer because you know, getting a new computer is gonna cost like pretty much two grand, which I mean, okay, fine. It's an investment. You don't have to worry about that for like another four or five years, but still I'm like, damn, like I don't wanna work. I don't want that. I don't wanna do that right now. So I was like, all right, let me just figure out my schedule a little bit with like working doing what I have to do like then, now I know I can't like download the same day as uploading as YouTube so I got my video done day before I, I wake up it's still uploading to YouTube and I'm like what is going on that was like a, what, a 24 hour upload <sighs> so I have to figure that out but that's been frustrating every week I feel like I'm dealing with some type of tech issue it's not the consistency because I'm consistent. It's just my tech gear. So we're up early today because I'm gonna go to the gym. I'm not sure if I'm gonna show you guys my workout. Um, it's pretty much going to be glutes, glutes and glutes and ass. So um, I'm up early. So to get to the gym early, I found a new gym. I'm so I'm like I love it. You guys have no idea. I hated my gym previously, and now I love my gym. And I'm like. <gasps> I love it, it's so good. So I might show you a little bit of my workout. Um, then we have an event with Sarah Vive. It's a morning event. Um, I forget what product they're launching. Don't mind me, it's really early. And um, it's in Hudson Yards, so I went to go to Hudson Yards earlier. Um, they're providing an Uber code, which is so helpful. So I wanted to go to that event a little bit earlier. Maybe I wanna, the shopping there is pretty decent, but I just never end up over there because nothing's really in the Hudson Yards area. Nothing's there. So I was like, all right, let's, whatever. Um, so let's go there. And then um, the event with Sarah Vive. I might, I might be going to a water park today. I won't take you guys along with that. But um, yeah, it's just, it's just, it's just been a week. I'm just, I'm just still like processing it all. But let's go work out. <laughs> Of 
course I'm running late for the event. Um, I actually have to upload my video, but my outfit's really cute. You'll learn, you probably heard about the skirt already in the video you're watching this upcoming or this past Sunday. This is a skirt, a dupe skirt from Amazon, the dupe for the Agba skirt. Um, very, very cute. I'm wearing shorts underneath because it is short, um, but, and I'm wearing it with flats. I feel like I definitely could not do this skirt and this look with heels because it was gonna be too much, but it's appropriate, but we gotta wear a short. We gotta wear a short for sure. I'm gonna wear like my Leve Sunnies. I got my, um, uh, well, I can't think of it. I can't think right now because I'm in a rush. Glasses, we're gonna do the Gucci horse bit for the pop of red and our little dupe little flats, a lot of flats. It's so cute. It's very hot today. Um, that's why hence I might go to the water park after this. But yeah, very, very cute outfit. Let's go. I'll, I'll see you at the event or in the cab. Bye. <laughs> I don't know how to stay at this thing long. And my outfit's so cute, but I'm wearing a linen shirt. And today, I, I'm definitely going to the water park on my hands. Cause this is crazy. It's definitely water park weather for sure. And like, it's, how, it's probably one of those New York summer days where nothing you wear is like gonna keep you cool enough. So, I'm gonna always the indoors, the outdoors. Let's see. Um, so I just needed to, um, I'm sorry, Hudson Yards area. Um, so I'm just walking to the event now. Can I tell you, when brands send an Uber code, it was so helpful. You see, I'm always hustling and bustling places. It was nice to sit back and let somebody else take charge <laughs> and drive and get me here. So let's get to this event. Girls hot. Opening, sorry, I keep messing my braids. Like an opening of the event, like 11 for I guess like people who are invited. Now the line is like I'm walking to the back of the line, Actually, an hour ago, I and it's really that. long. We used to do things that would be I don't think I'm waiting. Like I'm still, all these people to the to my right are waiting in this line, and I'll be honest, guys, it's, I don't think it's gonna happen for me. Like I'm still walking. I know they're giving away like free stuff, but um, yeah, it's it's honestly too hot for this. Like people have umbrellas because it's, it's hot today. Yeah, I'm gonna turn around. We're not gonna do that. Let me show y'all around Hudson Yards. Let's go inside. So I'm in Hudson Yards. We might actually come back here. I'm gonna have a little bit more time to like look and I'd be like rushing around because I'm trying to go. Now that I was outside, I'm trying to go to War Park now. But it's really beautiful. I just never end up this way, but they have some luxury and they have Marc Jacobs, which is behind me that way, which you can see. So you know how I have my little skirt on? This lady, so you saw how far that line went back. I was like, I just, I'm not doing it. I'm just not, it's just too hot. Um, and plus I have the CeraVe products that I like, like the face wash and the micellar water. I said, like, oh my God, your skirt is up on the side. I'm like, and I'm like, oh, first I thought she said my skirt was cute. So of course I'm like, thank you. And then she's like, oh no, it's up. I'm like, it's asymmetrical. It's supposed to be up. <laughs> this is the most peaceful Zara in New York City. This just doesn't happen. It's pretty. Like I love, especially with the top, but I'm just not sure if I need, but somebody else should get, go out there and get this. This is, so cute. Jewelry. This is, this is cute. It reminds me of something else I had that broke. I might pick this up. My friend sent this to me, and it's really, really, really pretty. Let's try this on. Let's try this on. I wish it was like, like more white. I don't know. So, um, 
this is, I think I need to make it more of a point to come to the Zara because the way how peaceful, I would have never been able to put my tripod down and try something on like in the city. So that was cute. I'm gonna run into H&M and I'm kinda, I need to get to this water park. <laughs> I need to get in some water. Um, plus I'm not really in a shopping mood. I think it's my PMS, my PMS vibe. Um, and plus they have a lot of higher end stores. It's a really, really nice mall. Let me see if H&M. They have like a little lemon. Um, I wonder if they have a food court. <laughs> like not a restaurant, an actual food court. It's online and I wanted it. It's burgundy, just like what I'm liking right now. And I thought it would be so cute in the fall. And it's like 20 bucks and it'll be gone. Today's episode of Jazz in the City. Maybe I should, I need to intro something. But yes, yeah, so you saw, I'm sorry, I haven't been back on the vlog in days. I apologize, guys. Nothing was going on and then I just felt like it was getting real choppy. I was supposed to go out to pretty much like a rooftop. Didn't go, end up going to dinner, going to bed and just nothing happened over the weekend. It was like very, very slow weekend so we're back um on the week today is what's today wednesday um a few things i want to take you guys to so on today's episode we are going down to the simon miller sample sale at this point i'm just going where the vibes are the vibes might be there the vibes might not we went to the last sample sale and it was a bust i feel do i feel good shopping energy possibly so we want to stop there i have an event later today with ikea it's the ikea sleep easy event it's supposed to be so much fun it's supposed to have um kind of it's like a pop-up um different things for us to try i think they're launching something i apologize i don't even know what this event is about but i'm going and then there's a gallery i may want to check out in wherever the world brings us and we're going to go have spent time with ourselves and have a midday brunch because the Ikea event is not till later. So yeah, I wanted to catch you guys up on that. I feel like there's something else I wanted to catch you guys up on. Oh yes. So um, really quick, cause we're, I, I don't wanna miss the bus again. Let me invite this off the screen. So the last time you saw me was at Hudson Yards when we had a day at Hudson Yards. Wow. Is that really the last time you see me? Yes, it is the last time you've seen me. So this is technically not a weekly vlog. This is technically like spending a day or two with me. But I end up going to Splashdown Water Park and it was so much fun. So if you have kids, just take them there. It's, if you live in New York, it's not that far from New York City. Technically, probably like an hour and a half. It's small enough where it's not overwhelming for the kids, not overwhelming for the adults. But it was such a good time. Like I just rode on some rides and it was just like the perfect day. Because when I tell you it was just like a New York hot summer day it was um so that day i showed you a few things that were new in zara that's really really cute i'm probably gonna have a zara mini haul new items video coming up soon but i want to tell you guys that i'm just trying to think of anything else that happened this week i cannot even think um yeah we ate the wangguan wagwan <laughs> tacos those were good the oxtail taco I, I, I absolutely recommend i'm not sure where their restaurant is based um but i'll link their information down below so yeah i just i'm sorry i just why can't i think about the week everything is like a blur I made it to the city and now it's doing some type of drizzle like a a soft drizzle and I don't have an umbrella not that I necessarily need one one of the pluses of having braids but it's just like annoying enough rain to annoy you and then I kind of went to eat at the taco place that you saw Ooh, I went to go eat at the taco place that you guys saw which don't go there it wasn't good it looked cool but it wasn't really that great so wasted money there. 
I just wanted to sit out some of this drizzle rain. Come out, it's not raining, and then now it's starting to drizzle again. So we we're pretty much in Soho. I stopped by Nespresso um, just to pick up some refills. I actually love the store. Everybody's just so <laughs> educated and informed. Um, so I went there, so now we're walking towards um, Lafayette to go to the sample sale. So hopefully it's, it's, it's a hit. I think I have decided that over the last sample sale, sample sale for me, and not in like a bad, look at my hair. I'll, I'll get into that. <laughs> look at this bun. This bun should tell you why this is no longer for me. So no judgment because we all love a good sale. You get the stuff and it's, it's pretty much like stuff that, I don't wanna say nobody wants because there is stuff that people want. By the time I was with this, kind of picked over. Saw that dress, remember I wanted that dress for my birthday? It would have been 75, but again, I'm just thinking a lot more when I'm shopping now. Like, I'm not gonna just get it because it's $75. Like, am I gonna wear it? You know, summer's pretty much over. That was a thing back in June. It's August, like, you know what I mean? Like, and I think sometimes you really have to think, especially somebody who shops as often as I do, I have to think a little bit more I have to just think a little, a little bit more. So, um, yeah, so I saw that dress and I saw another, I think I, you would have saw the other black sequin dress. Pretty dress, gorgeous. Tried it on, of course, too small, but it would have been a moment if it fit, because at least I, that's the dress that I can bring into the fall kind of on a night out with like a blazer over the shoulders. Fire, I might look that up online. But then you get to the fitting room. Now, granted, we know this is a sample sale, so I'm not expecting, um, individual fitting rooms, but then they have, they have such a, I guess they don't make use of the space well. So they have this huge area where they can kind of make things a little bit tighter for shopping and then give us a little bit more breathing room to try things on. It was just, it was just too much. It was so many women in there. And then there, it's like this, <laughs> it's like getting dressed and changing clothes, like in a, in a farm, <laughs> like at a farm, a barn. <laughs> and then like, there's a, the door keeps opening. There's people, men outside. It was just, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna sit this one out. I don't really need that. Um, so I probably should head out of town to go to the Ikea event. Um, let me see what's around here. I really am craving my cookie. I feel like every time you guys see me, I'm out getting this cookie. You be like, girl, you don't like any other desserts? I do. And oh, my hair's in this bun because I, I was trying stuff on and I had to get my braids out my way, but then had no space. So I just threw this crazy bun on top of my head. <sighs> yeah, <laughs> not for me. I think this is the last one, guys. I don't mind the ash. Ooh. Do I need these? another denim dress and this one is huge but I stopped in H&M and I thought this was so cute like I would definitely say go down a size but this is probably the cutest thing in the store because everything in the store looks very office they don't have a much like much variety but I just thought this was so cute just in case this is a medium and I'm swimming in it so I would need a small but I just thought it had such potential
just leaving the IKEA Sleep Easy event. If you saw, like all the rooms are really, really cool. Um, my favorite room was the dream room. It was a dream analysis. <laughs> and she's like analyze, uh, analyzing my dream, which is really cool. Um, it's so funny because like we take for granted sleep and better ways to sleep. Like right now, I really should be investing in a good pillow. <laughs> A good pillow i feel like my mattress is pretty decent but like my pillow is just uncomfortable and like we are i'm well i'm at the age where you don't sleep good you wake up in pain <laughs> so i was like i need to i need to get that TikTok pillow that's going viral something firm to keep my head up because between the lifting well, my neck to to your... everything so it was a really cute fun event um did i see anybody i saw a few of the girls there but that's it so i'm gonna just make my way back uptown we also gave like a cute gift bag which is here um which i'll open when i get home see what i got i think it's a cute robe which i need um i don't have a good well i do have a robe but um, this one feels like thick probably too hot for it right now but i'll show you guys where it's inside when i get home so i am back home from the ikea event um, the event was very cute. Um, like I said, I wanted to show you guys really quick the few things that were in the gift bag. It's not a whole lot, but just cute fun things. They gave a robe. I was hoping that a pillow was here. Here, right here, if you see this pillow often, it's my, it's my bed husband, which my chiropractor recommended. He has to have a chiropractor because I have back problems. I don't know. I think it's inherited from my dad. Um, they put the scent air that is the brand auto fragrance. So I can't wait to put this in my car. I believe this other thing from scent air is like a candle or something. I'll have to open that later. Some pillowcases and like this cute little throw blanket, which is really, really nice. So yeah, thank you for coming with me to that fun event. Maybe you got some, some decorative, decorative, um, inspo from the Ikea event. Um, so it was really fun. Um, stay tuned for the next vlog. I feel like the next two weekly vlogs are going to be jam packed. I know we said here that we're probably not going to do any more sample sales, but I definitely have a sample sale to go to tomorrow. Um, the brand invited me to go to the sample sales. So I'm like, ah, but it'll be fun. And we have some fun shopping things coming up that I think you guys are really going to enjoy. So stay tuned, um, for the next vlogs. If you made it this far, thank you for watching. Be sure to like this video and subscribe. And until next time, guys, be safe and be well. Bye.